my beloved ones, you will not starve and you will be known as the seed on earth the seed of the upright and the upright are the blessed on earth as it is in heaven praise the lord my beloved ones today our beautiful most amazing lord god jesus christ has come to bless us with another beautiful prophetic word and the lord god says that you are the seed of god and his seed shall be mighty on earth according to psalms 112 verse 2 the Lord God says, the generation of the upright shall be blessed. You are the generation of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob. You are the generation of the righteous people of God. You dwell in his presence because of your faithfulness, because the kingdom of God is within you. You are righteous because the Lord God lives within you. The kingdom of God is in you the rules of god the commandments of god are in you they are your shield you walk in the path of righteousness that's why the lord god says that you are the upright people in you there is no wrongdoing you're already redeemed by the precious blood of the lamb and for such is the kingdom of god it is true that you are upright and you shall be blessed and you are the seed on earth because already you have been blessed under the inheritance of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob. Not only Abraham, but Abraham, Isaac and Jacob. Because you are the seed of the Lord God of Israel, who is the Lord thy God of Abraham. The God of Israel is also known as the God of Abraham. Isaac and Jacob you are in his inheritance you are the upright people my beloved ones as you dwell in the presence of the living God as you seek the path of righteousness as you live for his name's sake my beloved ones you shall be known as the upright people and when you are upright my beloved ones you will lack nothing because you are the seed on earth the seed of righteousness you are the descendants of abraham and abraham is your forefather he is the father of the righteous one the people who have received his faith he is your grandparent hallelujah my beloved ones the word of god is always true the word of god has no lacking in it the word of god makes you the righteous one if you obey if you follow if you walk in the path of righteousness the righteousness is the righteous word the anointed word the word that i speak if you live by that word the word that you receive must manifest in your life the word is living if the word is living you are living if you are dead this word will be ignored by you you are ignoring the word you are still walking the same path of the old teachings you are not made upright unless and until you come in complete submission to the fresh manna the living waters the new oil because abraham is not the father of the dead he is the father of the living and only the living are being blessed with the faith my beloved ones god of israel is the god of living if you cannot receive fresh manna you are not even declared as the living so my beloved ones your forefathers sins must be forgiven the curses must leave you for that you must get connected to the living altar where you are receiving the fresh oil fresh good news of the living god the fresh word the fresh word which is now on earth as it is in heaven as the lord god is speaking in heaven i am prophesying it over you it is that fresh i am connected directly on earth as it is in heaven i am speaking here but as at the same time i am speaking in heaven as well because i am the voice of the lord when jesus is speaking in heaven he is speaking here to me my beloved ones, it is easy to deny the prophetic. It is easy to make fun of the prophets, but very difficult to be the upright. And if you believe in being the upright, you will follow the rules of the living God. The rules of the living God are to 
receive the prophetic. If you are still in your own mansion, in your old home, you need the renovation or you need to be the new creation. Your home shouldn't be the old. It should be the new home. It should be the new dwelling place for the living God. That's why my beloved ones, many fail. They fail because they are not upright. You are upright only when till the end you receive the fresh water, the fresh mana, the fresh prophetic word. If you fail in between, you have the danger of backsliding. If you stop receiving from the fresh living waters, you will backslide because you will stop then and there. But in the world of prophetic, in the renewed glory of the Lord, you become unstoppable. When you are unstoppable, you're still continuing, remaining connected to the father of life, the father whose tabernacle is in the living ones. If you have received from Abraham, if he is your father, if you have received from father Abraham, the faith of the righteous one, you are living. My beloved ones, you will not stop and you will be known as the seed on earth, the seed of the upright and the upright are the blessed on earth as it is in heaven. Lord is my shepherd, I shall not be in want. We thank all those who are honoring the Lord with their wealth and for all the offerings. We bless you with a hundredfold of return. My beloved ones, if you have not yet received our Lord God Jesus Christ, if you have not yet received the Holy Spirit, we shall pray a small prayer because this repentance is at hand. Our Father in heaven, we come into your presence through our Lord Jesus Christ. And today we receive salvation. We receive Holy Spirit into our heart. Oh Lord, forgive us our sins and help us to be born again. We shall seek you, O Lord Jesus Christ, unto Zion. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. My beloved ones, with this small prayer of repentance, your sins are forgiven and you have received Holy Spirit within you. You shall walk the walk of righteousness.